All right, we'll see you later in the newscast too, Clayton. Thanks a lot. Well, right now, a construction project on Sam Cooper Boulevard is nearly a year behind schedule. And now drivers are being driven to wit's end with delays and closures. Brad Broders is live along Sam Cooper for us this evening. So, Brad, where are we seeing those closures and, and how are people feeling about that? Yeah, Rudy, the construction impact on this stretch of Sam Cooper between Tillman and Highland is especially problematic this time of day during rush hour. While drivers said the construction improvements are important, they also say their patience is growing thin as they continue to drive through these road closure, lane closures and orange construction barrels. Terrible. It needs to be fixed quickly. It's a complete mess especially for people that's not familiar with this area. For drivers who rely on Sam Cooper Boulevard daily, frustrations are growing through this construction zone near the Highland Street Bridge and interchange. I did try to avoid it every day as far as like when people getting off work is five o'clock traffic. I try to avoid it by around that time. Seen from our ABC 24 drone, the city of Memphis led project is repairing 11 bridges and overpasses along Sam Cooper. It's happening in the roughly three mile stretch between Mendenhall and Holmes. A 2013 TDOT inspection rated six of those bridges in poor condition. I think when they finish with it, it'll be worth it. It's just, it's just taking so long, but I definitely think it'll, it'll definitely improve it. This city document originally targeted the completion date for June 2021, but that time frame is nearly a year overdue. Right now, drivers say they're tired of making adjustments in the area. Taking too long, taking too long. So we never know how, when, how long they're going to be, when they're going to be done, none of it. So we just patiently wait. I try to avoid the area by all costs if I can. Now, I've reached out to the City of Memphis Engineering Department on a construction completion update. And what factors caused the setback are the original construction completion timeline. But I've yet to hear back. I'll keep you posted as soon as I get that word. Live along St. Cooper Boulevard, I'm Brad Broders.